Welcome back. The fashion forward are trending toward eco-friendly brands, and today we meet three companies doing their part for the environment. I'm a big fan of vegan material. Tariq Alizbat of Nella Bella is clearly onto something here as fashion undergoes a revolution. His handbag collection combines sleek sophistication with an environmental attitude. They're cotton-based. Uh, they are layered with um, coloring that is safe and sound. That approach has won Nella Bella tons of fans, including Katy Perry. It's one of my highlights of my career. It's just it's nice to have you know one of the people that I admire in in the artistic side of the business, um, you know, to be carrying one of my bags. Canada's Bode and Christensen, renowned for their leather goods, also answered the current call of the wild, introducing their own vegan line. And then there's Bono's wife, Ali Houston, who tackled sustainable development in Africa with her line, Eden. From visiting there, we really got the message from Africans that although they appreciate aid and they need it to solve the big holes that they have in, in areas, um, they really want to trade. Fair trade in sub-Saharan Africa propelled entrepreneur Tal Dediar to produce his Canadian design shoes in the war-torn region. We can make amazing shoes in a country where, in a continent where no one's ever decided to make footwear, and at the same time, we change people's lives every day. Despite a rough start after trying to reach into the deep pockets on the Dragon's Den, the biodegradable footwear called Oliberté is now thriving. Quality shoes that sell in stores from, you know, Aldo, you know, Little Burgundy to Town Shoes to Urban Outfitters. Oliberté shoes are now in the U.S. and on some pretty impressive feet. Edward Norton, uh, Kristen Stewart from Twilight, Juliette Lewis, Canon. Lots of others. It's an easy story, great shoes, and more to come. Consumers are demanding it, but they're not demanding shirts that look like chip bags. They want products that stand for the right thing, but look like a $400 shoe.